Hello beautiful creatures. Welcome back to my channel, Fira. If you're new here, my name's Cordelia and I love bright and colorful gothic makeup, gothic fashion, mental health and lifestyle. So if these are things that you're interested in, be sure to click that subscribe button. Right now I am trying to upload videos every weekend. Um, I've had problems with my camera dying and various other issues. So, you know, hopefully I'll be able to be consistent again going forward, but click that little, uh, click the little bell notification so you never miss whenever my videos come out if you're interested in the topics. So today's video is a follow-up to my PRK vision correction video from about seven and a half years ago. So first you may want to know what is PRK vision correction surgery and why would you choose that over LASIK? So let me explain the difference to you. With LASIK, if you can imagine this is an eyeball, you make a cut in the top layer of the eyeball and peel this little flap of skin back, which exposes your um, cornea. The LASIK laser reshapes the cornea and then the doctors put the little flap of skin back and then it takes like three to four days and then your eye is healed and it's not very painful. It's a very quick process. Now PRK surgery is a little different. Imagine this is your eyeball and imagine this is the top layer of skin and the doctors completely remove that. So this is your cornea. They reshape your cornea and then you have to grow all of the skin back. Think like a skinned knee. That is why PRK surgery is so much more painful than LASIK. So why would I choose to have PRK when LASIK is so much less painful? Because my vision was so bad, I was like negative nine and a half in each eye, I was not a candidate for LASIK. My cornea was too thin, my vision was too bad, and I had like a major astigmatism. So it was just not gonna, it was not in the cards for me, it was not gonna work. So I had to do PRK surgery even though it was more painful. I had my PRK surgery done in 2015, about seven and a half years ago. And after my eyes had fully healed from my surgery, I had slightly better than 20-20 vision, which was awesome, and my astigmatism was gone. In the past six months or so, my uh, I, I've had a slight astigmatism develop and come back, which sucks. I had to go to a doctor and get a prescription for glasses, so I will actually show you my glass, glasses in the later half of this video so you can check them out. Now, I believe the only reason that my slight astigmatism came back is because of the work I do or the work I was doing. I um, Before I went into consulting full-time in tech, I worked in tech and I was working somewhere between like, I don't know, 50 to 70 hours a week, depending on the week. And I was always staring at at least three or four computer monitors and my phone screen and a tablet. So I had lots of screens up and I really think that the eye strain from doing that for so many hours a day, I think that's what caused these, uh, me to have a slight astigmatism again. So is PRK surgery painful? And I want to tell you that PRK surgery itself is not painful. The surgery itself does not hurt at all. And let me explain to you a little bit about how it works. So they put like a spreader in your eye. So if you've ever seen Clockwork Orange, you'll know what that is. But to me, it looks like a little lifesaver. So you can't blink. And they put drops in your eye to numb it. And then they also use drops that basically just take off that entire layer of skin. So it's gone. So then they expose the cornea. And you're laying down on this little thing. And I had like a little squeezy thing to hold on to, like a little stress ball so that I wouldn't freak out. Um, I actually, like uh, my doctor had given me two Valium for it. Or, and I took both of them and had panic attacks through both of them. So that was, that was fun. <laughs> and um, yeah, I, it was like, I think a minute or less than for each eye. So it was really, really fast. Not a problem at all, not painful at all. Now you may ask, is recovery from PRK surgery painful? And that answer is yes. My recovery from PRK surgery was intensely painful. I have a pretty good pain tolerance, or at least I, this is what I've been told by many people that I have a pretty good pain tolerance. And uh, it, it was incredible. I think pain in your eyes specifically is a special kind of just awful pain. <laughs> My recovery from this was so bad because I did not know enough at that time to advocate for myself to the doctor. And because my doctor was a man and I was a woman and he was like, oh, well, women don't feel pain. You know, like women are able to handle pain so much better than men or something like that. Basically, I was dismissed and diminished and treated as less. And my doctor had made some comment like, oh, men are such big babies about it, but women never complain because they go through childbirth, whatever. And um, I'm here to tell you that, at least for me, it was incredibly painful. <laughs> and if I had it to do all over again, I absolutely would have advocated for myself for some pain medication. So how long was it before I could see it clearly? I don't know about for everybody else, but before I could see clearly enough to look at a computer screen and work, it was about three to four weeks. My first two weeks, I think I was extremely miserable. Um, the first like two or three days, I 
don't think I got out of bed. I was in so much pain. I couldn't have any light in the room. At that point in time, if the room was pitch black and there was just a little sliver of moonlight, I could see like I had um, dark elf night vision, like I had drow night vision. It was awesome. Except for the fact that if it was any brighter, like I, I like my eyes would water. It was so painful. Um, I'm very grateful that I had help from Dave and my ex-husband to help me put drops in my eyes and keep me fed and everything. And I also was grateful for my standard poodle Phaedra who stayed by my side that entire time and tried to comfort me and guard me and keep me safe. Um, I turned to comedy when I, I turned to stand up comedy to try to make myself feel better because I was just in so much pain and so depressed over the whole thing. And I actually like at that point watched I, or listened, I didn't watch, listened to every single um, Aziz and Sorry stand up I could find because it just made me feel a little better because I was so miserable. If I ever were to do this sort of surgery again, I would absolutely call my doctor the next day or, or and say, hey, I need something for this pain because it's too much for me to bear. <laughs> so people have asked, would you do this again? And my answer is in a heartbeat. If there's one thing that I could do, I wish I could go back to my younger self in my 20s and say, get PRK surgery as soon as possible because it's so much easier than dealing with contacts and glasses all the time. Like my vision was so bad, I couldn't see further than this like from my face like so in the mornings I couldn't see anything everything was super super blurry and um, just thinking about the cost over time of how much money I spent on contacts and contact solution and glasses like getting PRK surgery was cheaper it is cheaper than what I spent all all of those years so if I could go back I would tell my younger self to do it in my 20s as soon as possible and that even though it was scary it was not painful except for the healing process and I could totally fix that now so I have to say, like people ask, do you regret doing it? And as I mentioned, I would know in a heartbeat, I would go back and do it again. I wake up every single day grateful now that I have 20-20 vision, even though I have a slight astigmatism, I still have 20-20 vision and that I can see. I am so grateful. I don't have to put in contacts and I don't have to wear glasses for my everyday life. Um, I do wear them only when I am looking at computer screens because that's when I get the headaches and the eye strain. <laughs> So if you are somebody who is thinking about doing PRK or vision correction surgery and your vision is like mine, like negative nine and a half in each eye, you can't see further than like, you know, a couple inches from your nose without your contacts or glasses in, I would absolutely recommend that you go talk to an eye doctor specialist. Um, I went to a place called LASIK Plus in Tampa. The doctor I picked had done like over 45,000 surgeries, not exaggerating. And I'm sure he's done way more at this point, probably 60,000 or something crazy. But um, I went to somebody who was very experienced and like, you know, he did this as easy as it was breathing. So I would talk to an expert and get their opinion to see whether or not you are a candidate for it. Now, I wanted to show you my glasses because I thought you might be interested in them. These are my glasses that I have from my eye doctor's office, which I think are very cute. And then I found a company online that does glasses called Zillow like Z-E-E-L-O-O-L -O -O -L. and I bought two pair from them and what's cool about these is that you can give them your prescription and they can make a prescription and and make your glasses so for the price <laughs> the price that I paid for these glasses and my exam and some other stuff uh, it was like less expensive to get these like much less expensive so I think I think I paid like oh, now I don't remember I put a number up here how much I paid for these two glasses total, but I want to show you what these glasses look like because I think they're pretty cute. I got a purple pair because my eye doctor's office did not have very many choices and and um, glasses frames, so I thought this was cute. It looks better. It looked better when it matched, or it looked cuter I think when it matched my hair when I had like the bright purple uh, magenta pinky purple roots going down to the purple. But what do you think? And then the other pair that I bought, which I think are really cool, are these awesome green glasses. So what do you think? Which of the three pairs of glasses do you like best? Do you like the first ones that are like sort of like a blue and tortoiseshell color, the purple ones or the green ones? I definitely want to know. Um, have you ever had PRK or LASIK vision correction surgery? Was it painful? Like what was your recovery like? Let me know in the comments below. And if you have any other questions, be sure to ask them and I will answer them. Thank you so much for watching my friends. I love you and I'll see you next time. Bye.